Hey everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a smooth parallax animation in Figma. No time to waste, let's dive straight into the tutorial. So, here's the setup. I've already prepared the website copy, text, and other content. The bottle image was created using AI. And I downloaded the background image from Lummy. First step. First, create a frame. Then, place the background image inside the frame and adjust it to get a good composition for the hero section. Now, add a gradient fill to the image and set the opacity to 100%. This will give a dark shade effect to the background. Once that's done, copy the heading text and place it inside the frame. Adjust the font size and style based on your preference. Create a CTA button and center it properly. This forms a simple a hero section. Now, place the navigation bar at the top which I've already designed it. Once everything is in place, add the bottle image to the frame, resize it to make it smaller, and move it downward and place it slightly outside the frame. That completes our hero section. This is the first part of the tutorial. Now, duplicate the first frame and position it to the left. Move all the text down and arrange like this. It gives a nice transition effect for the animation. Set the text opacity to zero. Do the same for the navigation bar. Next, move the background image slightly and zoom in a bit to adjust the composition. Once that's done, add another fill layer to the image and make it black. Duplicate the first frame again. This time, move all the text up and place it outside the frame. Set its opacity to zero. Now, bring the bottle image to the center and align it properly. Move the background image slightly downward to create depth. A parallax effect works by making the background move at a different speed than the foreground content. So at each frame, make slight adjustments to the background image to achieve that effect. Once that's done, Duplicate this frame and move the background further down. Now, shift the bottle image slightly and position it exactly where needed. Apply a progressive layer blur to the background to emphasize the bottle and create a focused effect. Tweak the positioning slightly to refine the layout. Once done, paste the text into the frame, which I created before. Copy the same text and place it in the previous frame and arrange it like this, and make opacity to zero. Now that the design part is ready, let's add animation to the website. To do this, click Prototype and connect the first screen to the second screen. Set the trigger to after delay and make the delay time 1 millisecond. For the animation, select Smart Animate. Change the curve to Custom and make it like this curve. Or just copy the curve values. Next, connect the second frame to the third frame. Apply the same settings but change the trigger to click instead of after delay. Similarly, connect the third frame to the fourth one. The prototype settings remain the same, but tweak the curve slightly to refine the effect. You can copy the exact numbers if needed. That's it. Now, all the screens are ready. Let's play the animation. Wow, it works perfectly. That's how you create a smooth and modern parallax animation in Figma. Thanks a lot for watching this tutorial. If you have any doubts, please feel free to drop them in the comments below. 
I hope you found this helpful. If you did, show some love by liking the video and subscribing to the channel for more awesome design tutorials in the future. You don't want to miss what's coming next. See you in the next video. Bye.